Tonight, a Valley community is fed up with an endless stream of visitors at one man's home. Neighbors in the HOA tell 13 Action News the visitors are tourists from all over the world who are couch surfing. And right now, 13 Action News anchor Masa Saidi is live right near Russell and Buffalo with how this unique website works and why neighbors fear nothing can be done to stop them. Masa. And Todd, Trisha, the website lets you travel all over the world and you can crash at different places for free. The county says because no cash is being exchanged, no laws are being broken. Still, neighbors say something must be done. A lot of the neighbors have been watching and we're nervous about it. Retired from the Air Force, George Burris has lived in this condo for yeah. 25 years. Every inch decorated. There's even a train in the corner to make this unit feel like home. But Burris says everything changed months ago after his neighbor started inviting travelers into his home 24 seven using a website called couchsurfing.com. I've had some of the couch surfers give me some real dirty looks, real threatening looks, nothing verbal, but I don't go out after dark. The website is a community of millions across the world. The goal is to travel and connect by letting people crash your couch for free. Burris says his neighbor is an active member with dozens of reviews. Fine for a quick stay, but not for a long time. Thank you for hosting us anyway. Tonight, the county says they investigated and closed this case. This isn't considered an illegal short-term rental because the host is not getting paid. Free or not, Burris says he doesn't feel safe at home. Even the HOA telling 13 Action News they feel the man is skirting rental rules. And the HOA says the man was using Airbnb before. Now you have to pay for that, so they were able to shut that down. They tell me they are working with their attorney to see what, if anything, can be done here. Meanwhile, that website does say safety is a top priority, and they have a lot of procedures and policies in place. Reporting live, Masa Saidi, 13 Action News. Masa, thank you, and we wanted to know if couch surfing sounded unsafe to you. We have a poll on Facebook right now, and so far, 76% of you say yes, 24% say the visitors are welcome.